And interestingly enough, the two cosmonauts that I trained with intensely for two years prior to the flight, uh, a week, three weeks before the launch, one of them was walking his dog in the woods outside of Moscow and a tree branch jabbed him in the eye. No. Yes, and he became non-medically qualified for the flight. Oh. And because just like you and the Blue Angels, you train together as a, as a pair, that yep. communication between the two is so critical that the other guy, uh, the non-hurt one, got pulled off as well. And they put a, pair, a, a, a flight engineer commander pair together. And that was Anatoly and Ivan, the guys I flew with. So just three weeks before the mission is when I linked up with these other the other folks. But to, to get back to the, the essence of your question, we get along really well. It, it's, it's just people trying, people on the same crew, doesn't matter the nationality, working hard to get the mission done safely and effectively and not screw up, you know. <laughs> and, and, and uh, you know, there there are times where, the bigger politics of the age, NASA versus Roscosmos, which yep. is what they have, which is influenced by our, our each each um, uh, polit country's political stuff. Yeah. Uh, that can kind of, you can feel a little bit of those tensions, but on the station, just like in an aircraft, it's people working hard to be safe and get it done.